Yo, what is going on everybody? I am your host Slack is Gaming, bringing you another Super Smash Brothers Ultimate video. Now, if you want to farm coins as quick as possible, I think I have a pretty fast method. I'm not going to say it's the, the fastest by any means, but um, yeah, so if you want coins, you know, and then come down to the shop to buy some stuff, whatever it is. Me outfits or spirits, well, wow, it's Gigamag 15,000, uh, but music, support items, whatever you want to buy, you know, with your gold, however you want to spend it. Um, I think I have a pretty quick method, and I've tested this out a few times, so now we're going to do it on video, so hopefully it works. So here's what you got to do um, one of the fastest ways it, to get like a very good chunk of coins, you have to come to uh, rule set for first of all. You're going to need, this is important, you need two controllers, and you can use the Joy-Cons that come with the Switch, you can use those. Either, you just need two controllers. And then once you have the two controllers, you have to have a time limit match of five minutes. You can adjust this, you know, higher or lower if you really want to, but I put it on five minutes just to show you. So, coin farm, that's what I call it. So here we go, pick a stage, go final destination, nothing, you know, where there's not going to be any, like stage hazards or anything that way you can just do this so it doesn't really matter who you choose honestly so but you have to have both controllers pick you don't you don't have to fight all right you don't have to fight all you have to do two controllers pick two characters characters don't matter either just pick two people and here's what you do this is really simple it's kind of weird but for the whole minute whole five minutes of the match eventually you're gonna have to get one ko get it towards the very end but literally click your stick down. Just do this. Just duck. For the entire five minutes. And don't stop. Because uh, the way I've been testing it, if I stop for a little bit, it seems to decrease the amount of coins that you get at the end. But I've been getting 2,000, 2,100. I got 2,400, I think, at one time from this. So, yes. I'm not going to show you the entire thing because this would be... I don't know. Maybe I will. I don't know. My... My sticks are really close to my mic. Let's see if I can uh, actually... Sh I'll do the whole thing. I'm, I'm doing the whole thing. This is going to be so stupid. You can fast forward a little bit in the video if you want to. But five minutes. Literally do this. Literally. You need... Yes. You need two characters to do this. I've tried it with one character. I've tried other methods. Like I've tried just spamming an attack like Fox. You know, spamming the B button. And that... That only got me like 200... 300 coins that did not get as much as this I don't know what's with clicking the stick down like this to keep doing the whole duck thing I, I, I don't understand it but do this for five minutes and you'll see at the end so yes it's a really kind of grueling and tedious way to, to get coins but if you want coins th I think this is one of the better methods and I bet yeah I've been doing other methods like I said I've been trying to spam attacks I've been trying to just run back and forth running back and forth that got me okay amount of coins it didn't get me quite as much as this I d again I'm not sure what the why clicking the stick down like this kind of ducking or whatever this is I'm not sure why this does it but I get you'll see at the end once we get to the five minutes but yeah just yeah I've, I've been doing this this is what I've been doing I've been testing this out, and this one seems to work the best. Some people are going to say, yeah, well, why don't you just play the game and get coins that way? This is for people that want to get coins really quick. I mean, hey, if there's a spirit or there's some me gear in the shop, like I was showing you a bit earlier, if there's something in there that you really, really, really want, and you just need some coins, this is a... <laughs> Sadly, this is a good way to do it. This is a good way to do it, but um, just keep, <laughs> keep spamming this. This is all I got to do. Again, two controllers. You have to be controlling both the controllers. Do not fight because I think I guess it's just the the more you do this, the the ducking motion, whatever. The more you do this, the better the result is for some reason. Again, I don't know why, but got to do this. And eventually, like right before the timer hits zero, have one of the other characters run off stage or something like that, just to get it over with quicker. That way, you don't have to go to sudden death because I don't think sudden death has actually been increasing the amount of coins I've been getting by any it's like it's it still makes it like the same amount so just save yourself a little bit of time at least have one of the characters just SD at the very end yeah this is I'm actually making a video about this wow really okay but hey only made it 45 left or we're, we're getting there 
We're getting there. This is one of the greatest Smash videos you will <laughs> ever see. Seriously? Alright. Um, Alright, what else, what else do we talk about? How's everybody doing? You know, um, the holidays are coming up. Christmas, Christmas Eve, New Year's. That's all coming up in the next couple days and weeks. Uh, that's exciting, you know? Oh, fingers are getting tired. Um, I guess, yeah, like I was saying a bit earlier, um, I, I don't know if more controllers, I have more controllers I could try this with, but I don't want to do, I don't know, you could try it with three or four controllers if you really want to, but it just tires out my fingers, so I'm only doing two, only doing two characters. Again, you can adjust the time if you want to do, like, more time, obviously, you'll get more coins, or do less time. Because I, I think, like, I'd say, like, I've been getting at least, like, pretty much, like, 2,000 coins. I guess there's a few times I got, like, 1,800, but that was, I was running around and grabbing items for a couple seconds, so. Just do this the entire five minutes. Don't run around. Don't grab items. Don't, I just said don't run around, but don't run around. Literally, just duck. Do this the entire time. It's the simplest way, I mean... Again, it's very boring, but it works. I'll show you results, obviously, at the end. I know there's another kind of method that says, actually, with King K. Rool, ironically. Um, use King K. Rool, go to uh, classic mode, go to 5.0 intensity to start things off. Beat Charizard. Quick! Alright, there we go. But uh, beat Charizard, quit and die or whatever, and then you get 300 coins, but that's like 300 coins in a minute. Here we go. Ready? Here comes the outcome. Watch this. Bottom right hand corner. Here we go. How about that? 2,400 coins. 2,400 coins in five minutes. That is almost 500 coins a minute. Almost 500 coins a minute. That's, that is nuts. That's nuts right there. So that, yeah, that's my quick, you know what? Let's, let's, um, let's just show, uh, I need, I'm going to back up and do different minute, different minute here. We'll do, um, yeah, edit, uh, uh, back up. We're gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna shorten the match just a little bit. Edit. We're gonna put it, we'll put it at three minutes, all right? I guess I'm gonna do the same thing. Save that ass. All right, but again, go to stage that you're not gonna get knocked around. There's no stage hazards. Nothing like that. Again, choose two characters. There we go. Start the match, and here we go. Here we go. Um, I'd suggest having, I don't know if it matters, I actually haven't tested this, um, but have player two always SD. That's uh, just the, I think, I don't know if player one SD would have any impact or, you know, negative, you know, I guess negative impact towards the amount of coins you can get, but yeah, I always have player two SD in case that matters for some reason, but um, yeah, so we're going to see this. So what do we get? We got 2,400 coins in the five minutes. So that that's almost, almost 500 coins a minute. So at this rate, we should be maybe, maybe we'll be around the 1,500 mark in three minutes because we're cutting out two minutes. So we'll see how this is. Again, just showing off testing. And of course, you can always fast forward to the results. Just see what happens. Because if, you, if you're watching the whole video of me doing this, um, shout out to you because you're amazing. You're literally watching me click two sticks down and have two characters duck. This is, yeah, that's what I'm talking about right here. This is the stuff that people come to Smash Bros. videos to watch. I mean, I think they, they don't really want to watch this. They just want to know the outcome. So, yeah, best way to get coins. Or, okay, I can't say it's the best way because there could be another method out there I'm not aware of. Or maybe a faster method. I'm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But back to that King K. Rule method I was saying. Um, if you don't know, choose King K. Rule in classic mode. Set it to uh, the 5.0 intensity, the max you can set it for to start the match. Beat Charizard. Immediately SD against Bowser. Or, I'm pretty sure Bowser's the second one. Anyway, the second fight, immediately SD. And then just quit. And you'll get 300 coins. But the whole process can take, you know... But, between beating Charizard and then restarting and the whole thing that could take a minute like a minute and a half maybe so that's a, and you only get 300 coins 300 coins is still good but 300 coins for a minute or a minute and a half isn't quite as much as what this gets you so 
This will be interesting. I haven't tested three minutes yet, so I'm interested to see what uh, what the amount of coins we get here. All right, we're almost there. We're like what, 51 seconds? We're almost there. We're getting there. Can't believe I'm actually doing this. Could have ended it. I could have ended it after five minutes, but no. I, I want I want to test this out. I mean, I've been testing out the five minutes. Again, you can test out whatever amount of time you want. You want to do 10 minutes? You want to do half an hour? Go crazy. <laughs> if anyone does more than five minutes, let me know your results. Actually, let me know your results in general. Does this work for you? Again, you have to be ducking like this. I'm pretty sure both controllers have to be doing this. Not just one of them. But do both controllers duck the whole time. Here, you run off the edge. We'll just get that out of the way. There goes player two, in case that matters. That way we don't go to overtime, because I'm almost positive. My results, overtime has not increased the amount of uh, coins, so quick, a few more. All right, there we go. All right, three minutes is up. Let's check out the results real quick. All right, so last time, five minutes got us a little over 2,400. Three minutes gets us almost 1,500. So there you go, almost 500 coins a minute. Almost. This is a... I guess it's a good way to get a good chunk of coins, <laughs> and it's a really stupid way, but th there you go. That's what I've been uh, testing. Uh, I'm going to continue to try to test other ways. I don't know. Jumping might do something. I don't know. I'll, I'll test other ways, and if I find something better, I'll make a video about that as well, but there you go. There's my video of how to get a lot of coins in, well, a short amount of time, so hopefully this helps people that are corn corn farming yeah hopefully you get all that corn you know that delicious delicious no hopefully this helps you with your coin farming but yeah that's gonna be it for this one so um hopefully this does help and again let me know your results if you do this let me know down in the comments please anyway that is it for this one hopefully it helps and hopefully we catch you on the next one peace out everybody